episode features. In this video, we'll be going over my trade idea of the week and the day by day probability model. So let's start off with the atomic analysis on the Winard chart. Wait in, pause MACD. We're approaching to overbought levels with the RSI. With the 4 average chart, we remain in negative MACD, but we did see it converge. As we extend that further to the daily chart, we are in pods of MACD. We did bounce right off the 200 day moving average, this green line at a price of $24.06. And as with the trade idea, I'll be trading SLV. My trade position size for is less than 1% of my portfolio. My long entry is at $22.30, and that is this range here. My sell target is at $23.26. My stop loss is at $21.99. However, if I were to open a short position, my entry is at $23.58, and that is its range there. My sell target is at $22.62, and my stop loss is at $23.91. So whichever entry price were to hit first, that will be my position of the week. So how did I develop these trade ideas? It all comes from the day-by-day -day probability model. And as we progress to the fifth day or week of trading, Silver Futures has a 50% chance to climb between 0 to 3%. To the downside, it has a 50% chance to fall between 0 to negative 3%. So if you enjoyed this content, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching.